EA Sports. It's in the game. Ladies and gentlemen, courtesy of EA Sports World of Boxing and the Hisako Ballroom, time to meet tonight's fighters. I smell pee. I think it's All right, so. So we could do. Yeah. Things are about to get underway here in round one. Hard shot married by Hatton. Good action as the counter really wobbles him at the end of that exchange. He returns fire and lands a punch of his own. Hatton's got it all happening for him. That counter haymaker sent his opponent back. Great counter skills. And falls it up with a huge haymaker that sends him back. He looks to work the jab consistently here. Ricky Hatton stuffers him in, lands big. Nice move and good follow up. Excellent move to avoid the uppercut by Hatton. He definitely looks shaken up there. That was a huge haymaker off a successful Haymaker causes his opponent to hit the canvas. Corrales collapsed under the power of that huge left hand. This is a great one for the highlight reels. This is because when Ricky Hatton was retired in 2012. All right, damn good work, kid. Breathe. I right. need you to breathe. So. This thug got some punching power, kid. We got I'll work him and so, keep him power shots far away. I'm doing a hol happy Halloween at Sunday. Breathe. Breathe. Sit down. That hey. round didn't go our way, okay? He's going to be constantly looking for a knockout. Don't expect too many jabs or any fancy footwork. Keep your eyes open. Let's get going with round number two. He works the jab. Ricky Hatton is able to do damage with that three-punch combo. He hits him hard with a big left hand upstairs. That worked well for him. Ricky Hatton is able to take away that hard punch. 
Corrales might have sustained a serious injury to his left eye with how swollen it's looking right now. Good X with a big right-handed haymaker and forces him back. Beautiful punch puts his opponent in a world of trouble. Let's see if he can go in for the kill and finish him off. Oh, he's hit by a killer haymaker. It could end his night early. Hit him perfectly. Watch this action. And boom, down he goes. He's got his champ in a sprint. We can put this fight in the win column. Here comes round number three. He's got to start protecting himself. If he keeps getting knocked down every round, this fight is as good as over. Hard right hand counter lands for Hatton. Morales has some swelling around his mouth. Ricky Hatton's unleashed a trio of zinging blasters. He took that one squarely. Ricky Hatton's tactfully executed that defensive move. That was a picture-perfect block by Corrales. Ricky Hatton's taking it to him with his jab. Corrales asking for it. His opponent has to take it. Wow, he goes down hard from that crushing haymaker. Wow, great shot. You can see how that right hand hit clean from this other angle. very well. Big counter shot sends his opponent really. He's got him in trouble now. Covering up his body well. Bang, and he stumbles back from a skillful haymaker off a counter move. Corrales can't possibly see everything that's going on with his left eye for the battle is rolling through. The crowd's going wild. They sense that there could be a knockout at any moment. He sticks from the outside and lands a jab. You see his Diego Corrales off his feet. This replay tells it all. No surprise that he went to the canvas after that shot. Six, 
sick. If he can keep that kind of aggression and accuracy going, this won't be the only easy round of the night for Hatton. The bell sounds, and the fighters turn towards their respective corners. too much on one skill set out there, kid. You got it all. So use it. Take it to him, kid. We're still in there. Take a breath and don't worry about that last round. Strength is in our corner, pal, when he stops moving. Please, give me some hooks and uppercuts. Here we go with round number five. Oh, Harry Hensley. Ricky Hatton landing a three-punch flurry. The crowd jumps in. Tremendous haymaker. Hatton hit him perfectly. Watch this action. And boom, down he goes. Why is because when um when Diego Corrales died, he passed away at 29. That would have been 30. and accuracy going this won't be the only easy round of the night for Hatton that'll do it for now time to head to their corners take a breath kid that round was all yours he ain't got no lungs kid he gonna be sucking wing damn quick stay on and beat him down we lost that round but we can come back you got to take everything in the dump truck and lay it on Put hands, footwork, and strong power shots. Here we go with the sixth round of this contest. He demonstrates a good chin by the way he took that uppercut upstairs. Bang, and that haymaker takes his opponent's wounds away by Hatton. Let the highlight reel roll. Let's see that shot one more time. Victory. His next opponent needs to study this tape if he wants to stand a chance.